we're about to start a video series where we're going to cover probably the number one most common question we get from customers is how, how to sharpen, sharpen the knife. knife. Welcome everyone to another video from Tops Knives. So we're about to start a video series where we're going to cover probably the number one most common question we get from customers is how, how to do sharpen I sharpen the knife? knife. Um, my, my best response is send it in and we'll sharpen it for you. But you know, I know a lot of people can do that. So Yeah, and a lot of people like to do it at home too. So that's what this video series is going to be about. We're going to cover um, a lot of different types of sharpeners. We're going to cover a lot of different tops knives so you get a chance to see large knives, small knives, Tanto, recurve, a lot of different styles and what works for those types of styles. Also, where you might be. So you know, it's going to be it's going to be a pretty in-depth series. I think we'll get multiple videos videos out of this. You'll get a chance to see these sharpeners in action. And speaking of these sharpeners, um, WorkSharp was kind enough to. Sponsor. You think they can tell it's WorkSharp? I don't know. I, I mean, maybe. <laughs> I think I, I think they could probably tell. But yeah, WorkSharp was kind enough to uh, send these over to us as, as the exclusive sponsor for this series. Um, they sent us all of these sharpeners, but many of us actually have some of, some of these in our home anyway, like the, the, this, uh, this the one Can here. Onion Edition yep. WorkSharp. I have one of those in my home. I use that to not only sharpen knives at home, but I also sharpen that was, lawn tools. Yeah, well, that was my whole reason of reaching out to these guys, because I think at the at the last show we did with, with, with them, um, I bought I bought a, a couple of these, and I yeah. took them home and I you know and I use them I, I use them not as much as I should because you know my wife keeps uh, you know giving me crap about it but, but I own a knife company but my knives are all, all <laughs> dull but but yeah I, I bought some of these and and I and I liked the the the, the system that they incorporated with Ken Onion to, to make these yeah you know that that was pretty clever and then they they came out with uh, this what's that own with this one the precision yeah adjust. the precision adjust. That one really caught my eye, and after that, after seeing that one, that's when I wanted to, you know, um, and when we talked about getting a hold of them and uh, uh, bringing them on to see if they wanted to do something like this with us. So, yeah, it'll be it'll be a good little little uh, set of videos that we're gonna do with all these. Yeah, yeah, and I mean the, the question, how to sharpen my knife? The answers to that are almost there's almost as many ways to sharpen your knife as there are knives in the world. You know, and the I, way Leo even his. yeah, even last night that we were that we were talking about this with Craig, you know, he does it one way because you know he, he he does a lot of research on this. I do it my way because I've seen uh, my my relatives and 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 my and see a lot of my relatives are butchers and and they they've been doing uh, in the in the food uh, um, I don't know what what you call it, but but they've been working with food and making food for a long long time, and so the way that I've seen them sharpen their knives before they either kill a pig or whatever they do. Um, that's how they, that's how I seen it, you know? And then yeah. Craig comes in with this new method. And I'm like, Craig, you're doing it wrong. He's like, no, look. And he shows me videos, so, <laughs> yeah. you know? So, so yeah, there's so many. So the way that you guys will see us sharpening is not the, it could be right, it could be wrong, but it worked for us. Same thing with you guys. If, it, if this works for you and you guys are getting a razor edge on your blade and you guys are doing it upside down, do it. You know, I'm not saying that my way is right or his way is right or wrong, yeah. but this is this is how I grew up sharpening, and when I what I mean grow, growing up sharpening here at Tops. You know, I've been doing this 20 plus years, and when I started learning how to sharpen, you know, belt going forward, and I'm sitting behind it. You know, and and so I try to use I apply that same method to a sharpener. You know, if, if it's here at the shop or in my house, I try to use the same the same method. Yeah. And when I see Craig going opposite, I'm like, you don't do it like that. But yeah. he's not and wrong see, because people sharpen like that. And see, I grew up yeah. learning from my, my grandpa and my, my dad. The way my grandpa sharpens knives, he does circular motion on a stone. And I cannot do that. Yeah. But he could get knives razor sharp doing that. My dad does kind of a in-between. And and I, you know, so I kind of found my own way that I that I do it. And so if you're out there and you're 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 a master at sharpening. You'll probably get some entertainment out of these videos, but you, know, you might not learn that much. This yeah, is and, but, but you know, people are, have to understand that that the regular Joe Blow doesn't doesn't yeah is not a master sharpener. Doesn't have a grinder at home. This, they're going to see one of these for the first time probably in this video, so they're going to want to pick one up and try it. Yep. And I and you know and I encourage that because 
you know, it's always cool to pull out a pocket knife and it's razor sharp. Yeah. The first thing somebody grabs a knife is feel the edge. First thing you do, you before you admire it and look at it, you feel the edge. I don't care if that thing is a ten thousand dollar knife, you feel the edge. Yeah. That's how it is. Yeah, one hundred percent. So yeah, in the in the video, like like I say in the in the series, we'll cover all sorts of sharpeners from from pull through sharpeners up to like a powered kitchen knife sharpener, um, and then some of the some of the newer items that Workshops come out with. Uh, really, we've got a little bit of everything in this. We got yeah. powered sharpeners. Uh, stuff that's easy to take out into the woods with you. Even that even kind of even with us, Craig. Even with us, like, like all those little hand ones. I carry one in my backpack to touch up an edge when 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 it gets a dink and it fall or something. But we carry one of those. Yeah. I think we went to a, the the local place where wherever we were at the show and pick one up and just to touch one. up the edge. You know? Yeah, yeah. So they we, work. Uh, every time we rent an Airbnb, we sharpen their knives. Yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> they're always just terrible. <laughs> and so you know we we we. Uh, we, we think that we're gonna get a lot of a lot of good content for you guys out of this. Yeah, absolutely. You'll see, you'll see all sorts of different things. We'll talk about grits and and angles and and all of that stuff. Sharpening can be a really simple thing and it can be a really complex thing as well. We'll try to we'll try to cut, we'll try to cover all the bases. Right Correct. Here. And you know, and some people some people will take it to the extent that they, they spend hours on a blade. Perfect. Yeah. Some people will just want to put an edge on it and keep going. And that's good too, you know. So if there's tips and stuff that you guys can help us to do these handheld ones, let us know, man. I'm, I'm, I, I want to learn to do this, yeah. you know, because I can take it to a grinder and I can get a heck of an edge on that. But stuff like this, you know, to me, it's going to be new too, you know. Yeah, yeah. So. And so if you have questions that you want us to answer as we go through the the series, ask those as well. So since we're covering all that, make sure that you you're subscribed to our channel. Make sure that you've got the post notifications on so that when we drop a new video. You, uh, you're there to see it. Um, we'll be sharpening tops knives in these videos, just in case you're wondering. Um, but yeah, we, we, we'll be able to show you really a little bit of everything from kitchen knives. The tracker, the tracker has been one that we, we get questions every show, every at least. Show. And I know on our social media, we're getting questions on how to sharpen this. This is one that we'll be going through. Um, and hopefully we can make it work on our side, but, yeah, no, but it, it is we'll, pretty easy. You know, we'll it looks be able to like dedicate a whole video but, just but to is, this knife. But it is, but it is pretty easy. You know, it, it's not, not, uh, yeah, it's not rocket science to do something like this. It's scary because it's a little bit different shape. Yeah, you, but, you, yeah, you look at the blade like this, and you're like, so many angles, you know, so many places to sharpen. You know, you got three, the teeth and the two bottom edges, but it's not bad. It's really yeah, not bad. Yeah. So, you know, we'll, we'll cover. We'll talk about. Um, we'll cover recurve knives as well. So. We've got one of ours, it's called the Desert Sun. Really cool little blade. A lot of people shy away from recurves because this, this curved part is difficult to sharpen unless you have the right tools or know how to do it. Um, so we'll cover some of that kind of thing. We'll talk about tanto points. Tanto hatchets. points, hatchets, you know, like, like our Hammerhawk. Um, yeah, see, like, they look intimidating because of the thickness and stuff like that, but they're really not. It's really just a normal blade you're sharpening. You know, focus just on your blade edge more than the whole, the whole, the whole thing. Yeah, so. and same thing, same thing with large knives. I mean, this is this is a big. I mean, it's a long blade. It makes it difficult to. It, it's daunting to look at this and think, um, how am I going to run this over something like this? But you just apply the same principles you would for a shorter knife, and you can do the same thing on a longer knife. So. Anything that you've got in your house that you're thinking, man, I don't know if I could sharpen that, we're gonna try and cover kind of all those bases. Scandi grinds, uh, kitchen knives, recurves, the tracker specifically, all of that. So, so if there's blades, to... guys, if there's blades that we show and, and, one, and you guys wanna see something different because you guys have it and you guys don't know how to sharpen it, let us know. You let us know and, and we can you know, even do a little small clip or something on, on how to sharpen that one. Um, so yeah, let us know what, what, what you guys are having a problem with and, and we'll, we'll, we'll try to address them. All right, so kind of towards the end of this series, we'll probably also be setting up a giveaway where we'll, we'll give away maybe a, a couple of different sharpeners and a couple of different knives yeah, to go along with them. So make sure that you're watching, make sure that you're, you're, you're interacting and, uh, um, and uh, you'll get more chances to win that way. Yeah, so like some of the videos we did uh, in the past where we asked questions and stuff like that, they're gonna be simple. So if you guys are following these videos, you know, we'll ask a couple questions. Hey, what knife did we sharpen with this one? And you guys are getting it. You guys probably get that sharpener and knife. You know, I'm, I'm, I think I think that'll be pretty cool. Yeah. Cool. So guys, go, go visit Workshop. Guys, seriously, we, we, we partnered up with these guys, but we personally use them. 
So go thank them for doing this stuff to show you guys how to how to how to use it. Um, we we like their stuff. That's the reason we again why why we're using it. Um, so it's good stuff, guys. Reach reach out to them. You yeah. know, reach out to them. They they make good stuff. And and I mean, aside from just what we have on the table, they do have some other sharpeners. They actually have a, a, a powered system that's specifically for woodworking tools, and they've got a couple of other things on their website that we that we don't have here. So. There, there's really kind of something for just about any kind of tool you might need to sharpen there. And I mean, this is, this is what they do. So uh, they're, they're very good at it and we're, we're happy to be partnered up with them for this video series. We've got more videos coming, keep an eye out for all of that. So make sure that not just here on YouTube that you're, that you're subscribed, go to our other social medias as well. Check out our Instagram, our Facebook, our TikTok if you're into that. Um, on Instagram, help us out, hit the bookmark button on posts that you like. That helps us show up in your feed and show up in other feeds so that we can keep growing this. Uh, this yeah, Instagram's being weird right now, guys, so that'll help us out. You know, hit that bookmark and uh, follow what we do. Take care, everyone. Thank you. Peace out, guys. I got a job in the valley, but today I didn't go. She got